Hi, good day. My name is Marius, uh, well known as Mace. Um, and I drive a Toyota Corolla, old box Corolla, box shape. Um, currently, there's a dual beams uh, set up in. The reason why I like this, this car, is I had one, the previous one, and I couldn't forget about it. So I purchased another one, was decent. Um, and I changed it to a dual, dual beam setup, the same as the, the previous one. The engine is makes a lot of power, standard, and that's one of the features I like. And the Corolla just drives like one of the modern vehicles. So I think, and a beams in a box is like peanut butter and jam. It just suits each other. Done, done nothing to the interior. I bought a car from a mechanic, his name is Clement in, in Somerset. Um, when I bought it, it was in a decent condition. I just resprayed it, um, put some other stripes on. Um, it had a uh, 2T original um, modified engine with side rafts. And um, I came across a beam setup and I had to change it because I know what the engine is capable of. Since I came into the car scene, I wanted these runs and never got it. And I purchased this set in, uh, in Johannesburg. Um, this guy did post the ad. A friend of mine in Strand uh, sent me the post. He was posting his whole vehicle, Cressida, and I asked him about the rims. So a month after that, he contacted me, I can, I can buy it. So I bought the wheels. I had to buy these wheels. If you know you, you know. So, yeah, that's how I came across this TSW Stealth, and it's a 17. The beam stands for breakthrough. Engine Advanced Mechanism System, if I'm right. Um, what happened, we didn't get the 3S in South Africa. Um, yeah, you get you got the 3S range, like a Camry uh, engine code also starts with the 3S. But what they did in Japan, they took the 3S sub-assembly and opted let uh, Yamaha do the, the cylinder head. That's where the beams came in. And when South Africa bought the import engines from overseas, that's how we came across these engines. You never saw it in a vehicle here. The front wheel drive 3 GTE, I think, was common in the Salicas. That uh, engine was popular in South Africa, but not this one, if I'm right. <laughs> I've owned a lot of cars. Um, if I go now specific to these type of vehicles, I had a, a red one like this, also dual beams. I think it's about 10 years ago. And I had a triple S um, Datsun also. And I had a two row in this also. A box 1300 two row. And two Rannicks as I had. So I'm actually a Toyota fan. I just want to give a big shout out and thanks for Gerald Golding uh, for doing the job and Truton Meg Repairs um, for sorting out these wheels, uh, Powerflow Exhaust um, for the sweet sound and Leroy's car was for keeping it clean and anyone else that I currently don't know of, thank you for helping me with this project. You see the car currently has a, a owner, so I'm, I'm never gonna sell this one. Not this one again, I'm not gonna lose a one. And my daughter is, one day this is her, this is her vehicle.